<clears throat> Mr. Ongwen, as presiding judge of this chamber, I would like to ask you some questions on behalf of the chamber. Mr. Ongwen, on 21st January 2016, do you remember being in this courtroom for your confirmation hearing? Yes, we are. Yes, I do recall. At that hearing, Mr. Ongwen, do you remember being asked by a judge if you were fully aware of the charges? We are poor. I do recall being asked that question, and I do recall answering that I do not understand the charges against me. You say you do recall that you answered uh, that you do not understand the charges. Um, do you recall saying, if for, give, give it a second thought, um, that you have, and I quote, said that you read and understood the document containing the charges? I did understand the document containing the, I do understand, I did understand the document containing the charges, but not the charges, because the charges, the charges I do understand as being brought against the LRA as not, but not me, because I'm not the LRA. The LRA is Joseph Cohen, who is the leader of the LRA. Is it correct that you received this, the decision confirming the 70 charges also in Acholi? Yes, I did receive the charges in Acholi, but I reiterate, it is the LRA who abducted people in northern Uganda. The LRA killed people in northern Uganda. LRA committed atrocities in northern Uganda, and I'm one of the people against whom the LRA committed atrocities. But it's not me, Dominic Ongwen, personally, who is the LRA. It's uh, enough to give us a, a certain basis to decide on the question if the accused understands the nature of the charges. But we will have uh, to, to deliberate on that, of course, uh, for a couple of minutes. I would say we will be back at approximately 15 minutes.